Well, the Chubbuck workshop is set to be launched in the Middle East for the very first time. Chubbuck's 12-step acting technique uh, comes uh, with Zara Star's productions and it's proud to announce the arrival of the power of the actor workshop featuring the renowned 12-step acting techniques of Ivana Chubbuck. To talk more about this workshop and how you can apply is uh, Australian actor Alex Brun, who's joining us uh, via Zoom this afternoon. Alex, thanks very much for your time and joining us on Talk 100.3. It's a pleasure, lot, and good to speak to a fellow Aussie. Yes, it is. You went to NIDA. That's that's one of the most uh, uh, pres- near one of the most prestigious academies. I'm thinking uh, Russell Crowe, Mel Gibson was there. They were NIDA graduates, Mel weren't Gibson they? Was there. Judy Davis, Kate, the wonderful Kate Blanchard was there. Sam Worthington was there. Um, more recently, there's been many, many wonderful, wonderful actors who've come through there. Um, stars of Succession, stars of shows all over the world. So I guess given you know, you've been through one of the, the most prestigious acting um, uh, um, facilities in the world and now you're bringing here uh, alongside uh, Claire Chubbuck this fantastic 12-step acting technique. Uh, for anyone who wants to take part in this, who is it for? I mean, is it for someone that has a little bit of acting experience and maybe did something in high school? Do you need any experience previously or can anyone turn up and, and, and learn some of the secrets from the pros? Well, look, I think the first thing you've got to say is that um, uh, Claire coming to Dubai, this is the most exciting thing that's ever happened to the local theatre community. I mean, Claire and her mother, Ivana, of course, these people are the real deal. They are the top acting coaches in Hollywood. So, if, you know, if it's not like Charlize Theron's going to go for an acting class, they're going to go to Ivana Chubbuck. Sylvester Stallone is always sworn by her acting technique. So these are the top acting people in the world, essentially. And this is the first time someone of this standard has ever come to Dubai. I mean, listen, I've, you know, I, I come come through NIDA myself and I've, had, I've been lucky to work with people like Nicole Kidman. I've been lucky to work with Kylie Minogue. Um, I've been lucky to work with Kate Blanchard, you know, many years ago. So I've had that experience with them. But, I mean, Grace has worked with the top, Claire, sorry, has worked with the top actors around the world and especially in Hollywood. So this is really a chance. So you don't have to go to Hollywood. Many, many people in actors in Dubai or people who want to be actors, they get on a plane, they fly all the way to Los Angeles and they'll do a workshop with someone like Larry Moss, you know, or maybe someone like David Strasberg. But Grace Chubbuck is of that standard and of that quality and she's going to be right here in Dubai. So if you only do one acting workshop this year, next year, for the next 10 years, then this is the one you should come to. This is incredible. I mean, the, the way you have put it, it just puts the right perspective in the mind of anyone who's listening and trying to understand what could be it. But, you know, when, when you put it out in a simplified manner, you know, the 12-step acting technique, what is a 12-step acting technique? Because I'm sure that, you know, from, from Lee Strasberg to uh, the, the, this uh, technique, the Schaubach uh, technique, everything has a special ingredient in it. What is the 12-step acting technique in that case, Alex? Well, I won't go through it all because, um, you know, uh, we've got limited time, I guess, in the program and also Grace will be here. And it's also spoken about in Ivana's book, um, The Power of Acting, which is a Bible for actors. But essentially what she's drawing on is the Meisner technique. And Mm. I'm a a big uh, disciple and a big fan of the Meisner technique. And a big thing about the Meisner technique and the Chubbuck technique is uh, emotional recall, basically, or using your own emotional experiences, drawing on those to create a performance and you wonder you know you watch a a film and you see the actor is breaking down emotionally or is just tears are flooding down their face and you think where are they getting that from how are they doing that how can they just bang you know on a film set with 50 people suddenly be crying like that and sometimes the technique that is used is emotional recall or you know locking into your old, old memories but the thing about this neil that's really important is it can be dangerous it can be dangerous as as well Because if I'm going to ask you to go back right now, Neil, and think about the most traumatic experience in your life, okay, that's going to take you to quite a dark place and Mm -hmm. quite a sort of scary place. So it's not only about teaching actors to go to that space, but also to come back from that space so that when the camera calls action, you're back right now, Neil, happy and fine today, not back where you had that really tough emotional experience, which you need to draw on for the scene. So getting into the scene and getting out of the scene are really, really important. Well, I was I was going to come, Alex, but all my ex girlfriends tell me I don't have any emotions. <laughs> so, so so I'm not I'm not much sure I've got anything to draw off in order to come by. Now, 
Well, Lachlan, you probably draw on a lot of ex- e- emotions when you watch an IPL game. Maybe you could just draw on an IPL yeah. game for that. For <laughs> Sp- that actually, you know what? Yeah, the, the last few times I've cried, I think they have been during when my sports, my Sydney Swans have lost or something. So I can draw <laughs> I can draw on those. He, 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 you'll find him well, emotional well, right now. <laughs> the Sydney boys just lost the football well, the game. The grand final last year was a deeply, deeply traumatic experience for every <sighs> Swans fan. I watched it at the Gettigans alongside some Geelong supporters. So it was a deeply deeply traumatic experience so i can understand that but (laughs) listen as to who the workshop is for it's really for everybody because what grace is going to do over the three days is she's going to take you through this technique and the thing about acting is you can often learn lots of really bad lessons you can learn lots of bad lessons and there can be not good acting teachers teaching you the wrong things so if you're going to come in even never done any acting before in your life and just come in and, and take and go through this Grace Chubbuck experience and, and, and learn the Chubbuck technique, the 12-step technique. It's going to make a massive difference to you, uh, not only just as an actor, but as a person as well. I mean, Stella Adler, again, who is one of the great acting teachers of all time, what Stella Adler said, personal growth is the same as acting growth. So to grow as an actor, you need to grow as a person. So even if you're not that interested in acting, you're going to come along on the weekend and you're going to learn so much about yourself. Right. You're going to deep dive into this uh, experience over a weekend and you're going to learn so much. And I think that's what we want in Dubai. We want to get in there and just bang, do it. We want the full-on experience right now to go through it and experience it. So you can't get a better introduction to this than the three days with uh, Grace Chubbett. No, this is very, very interesting. You know, you, you spoke about Meisner a while back. Uh, I, I did do an acting workshop where, you know, we were spoken about the Meisner technique. And this was back in India, Alex. And uh, during that process and, and, and in the, 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 the things that you mentioned, going back to your emotional backgrounds, picking up a story from the time when uh, you, you, were, you were down and out completely in that dark space. Some of us took a lot of time to reach there. Some of us reached instantly. But the worst part was like you mentioned, coming out of it. Some people, and, and I know this from personal experience, Alex, haven't have, have probably been associated with that emotional side now so much. Even they, they don't even, uh, you know, are, they're not even actors now or not, not practicing acting as a profession. But still, if you see, their emotional side has been opened up so beautifully that something happens and you know that when they react to a certain thing, it is the true emotion. So a, as an actor or not, you do get connected to the to your emotional self beautifully through Meisner. Yeah, I think that's a great point, Neil. It's a great point. And it is that, you know, so even if, you know, you're not, even if you're only just going to be acting in life, and there's a lot of acting in life, you have oh, to walk do. into a meeting, a big business meeting like people do all the time in Dubai, you know, in front of 10, 15 very important people. You have to make a presentation. You have to act confident, act strong, uh, project the right image, you know, make sure people believe in and believe in what you're doing. Even you two guys now sitting right now on radio, that in a way is an acting in a way, you know, you're projecting a certain image to your listeners, etc. A, a certain part of Lachlan, a certain part of Neil. So I think there's a lot of acting every day in everything we do. So to come along to this meeting, you get this um, course, you're going to understand those techniques and the way that they work. And also when you're faced with a difficult situation in life as we are, it can also help you to deal with those emotions. Yeah. I, I mean, there is a, there is a quite a bit of you know therapy. Honestly, really, I think good acting and a good acting teacher is part therapist because you need to go through stuff and deal with stuff to be able to use it in your work or else what can happen is like, you know, amazing, amazing people like Heath Ledger. You know, Heath Ledger went so far into the Joker and into the yeah. Joker's character that he never really came out of it, Heath. He never really came out of it, you know? And what an amazing guy, what an amazing actor and what he did. But, you know, you have to learn these tools to be able to deal with stuff and deal with quite emotional stuff and then to be able to come out of it. And that's something we need to learn with life, not just with acting, but as life as well. well and, yeah. you know, Chubbuck over these three days is going to give that to you. Well, if you do want to be a part of it, the Zara Stars Foundation is offering an exciting opportunity, uh, 60%, 65% off on the workshop cost by asking actors su- to submit their acting videos. If you want more information, you can check out the Zara Stars production Instagram account at Z Stars Productions. Uh, Alex, uh, it's been exp- inspiring and also quite insightful uh, to hear your story about the importance of acting and also uh, what you can expect with Chubbuck's 12-step acting technique, uh, arriving in the Middle East for the very first time. Uh, thank you very much for joining us on Talk 100.3.
Thanks, Lock. Lovely to meet you and lovely to chat to you and Neil. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you very much, Alex. So, yeah, quite insightful about uh, an insight into actors. I mean, we see the Hollywood stars and think it's all glitz and glamour, but some of them have to work so hard and learn to control their emotions so much. No, see, this is what it is. You know, uh, one of my acting coaches, for the first time when I met him, he asked me one simple question. Neil, tell me, you want to be an actor or you want to be a star? As much as I wanted to say that I want to be a star, I said, no, I want to be an actor because someone had told me he asks this question. And if you say you want to be a star, he kicks you out. Well, if you do want more details, as we said, Zara Stars Foundation offering uh, that opportunity. Check out their website at ZStars Productions on Instagram. TSB Talk Sport.